returning overseas, there was a bang and suddenly a gaping hole in a jetliner over war-torn Somalia today. And Margaret Brennan has that. Cell phone video shot on the plane while still in flight shows oxygen masks blowing in the wind near the hole in the Airbus 321. Some passengers towards the back of the plane can be seen wearing their own oxygen masks. Once on the ground, the damage to the plane was clearly visible, with pieces of the fuselage curled out from the body of the plane. All 74 passengers and crew were evacuated. Aviation officials say two people were injured. The Somali-owned airline was on its way from Mogadishu to Djibouti when just minutes after takeoff, the rupture ripped a hole in the fuselage. Somali diplomat Awale Kulane was on the flight and said on Facebook that he heard a loud noise and couldn't see anything but smoke for a few seconds. After the smoke cleared, he realized quite a chunk of the plane was missing. U.S. intelligence officials are aware of reports that there may have been an explosion, but it's unclear if that's from a structural failure or a bomb. Scott, the Al-Qaeda-linked terror group Al-Shabaab controls part of the country, and ISIS is expanding its footprint. Margaret Brennan in the Washington newsroom tonight. Margaret, thank you.